what's up guys and welcome to another episode i am your host today i'm going to show you guys how to make a soca slash afro beat track using nothing but my laptop and of course my monarch sample packs all right let's go. All right, first things first, uh, we go to the, the folder that has the Monarch samples. And as you could see, there's one of eight tracks that you could choose for, one of eight loops with all the stems and everything. This is an example of what the, the stems sound like. So there's eight of these, each of them are broken down into stems, so you could choose each um, each one that you, you, you'd like. But for now, uh, we're gonna just start off with a blank slate. Uh, we're gonna just drag in a couple of samples. Uh, these are some of the loops that we have, but we, if you notice that the, the sample is 103 BPM by hour, project file is 115. So what I need to do is open the flex tool and just crank up the speed, bring it down. So everything is aligned. So this is the loop that we have going on for now, right? Again, I'm not going to use any keyboard or anything. And then I'm just going to go through. Um, so I'm just going to go through each of the sample stem, uh, the sample files that I have, and then just, just basically drag and drop different elements into creating this rhythm. Uh, this is 125 BPM, so I know I might have to stretch it. That sounds good. Let's take another element from that. Uh, stretch it the same way. All right. We could just take different elements from different songs. Uh, let's take one from Tropical Birds, just see what the Hyatt's would sound like. I know it's in a different tempo, so I know automatically I would need to fl use my Flex tool. To find your Flex tool in Logic, you just click this icon right here, and then you just change the settings to whichever that you want. For now, I just use Speed because that's what I'm using just to adjust the time, the tempo. See? And this we have a track already. So all we do is we just we're just taking different elements from different songs and then we're just gonna put it in. So I kinda like this one, so let's drag this one in as well. Change it to speed as well and then drag it the same way. Uh, let's look for some bongos or congas. Uh, I'm just gonna just drag in anyone from any one of these files and see if they work. That's the beautiful thing about using these stems. They all work. So you could just mix and match and create your own tracks basically. coming um, let's try a little more iron let's see how that works so this is already mono pan left so I'll just pan it left adjust the volume so everything sits properly That's sounding good already. Uh, let's try Mercury. Let's see what we got from here. Let's see if we could just drag some, some of the congas and see if the congas would work. Same thing, go to your speed. And drag it down. So this is the congas. So I would probably add some just some delay just to fill in some of the gaps inside this.
Ya se va a avisar. See, different elements that actually make the song. And you see, we have a rhythm already. So all we're missing is just some hi hat and um, kick for sure. Let's add the kick and from the stick. Kicks from the tropical snare. So of course the kicks are off. So now of course if you do not want this kick pattern, then it's easy. All you do you just create a software patch uh, in 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 Logic, and then what you do after is um. You open your drum machine designer and then you could just drag in the kick sample. So inside the soccer kit, and then you go to one shot. You could either go to chat shot chat toppers or the radio ready sample files, and then you just choose the kick that you want. Alright? Simple. You could either choose this kick or this one or this one. Right, just choose the one that you want, but for time purposes, I'm just gonna just use a kick that I've already done. All these kicks are mixed and mastered. All right, so now what we're we missing, we're missing a snare. So let's go to uh, let's let's take the snare from the tropical bird since we already used the kick. Let's use the snare from that. See, and we have already rhythm already. So what's missing? We're missing the music element. All right, so, uh. Luckily, I have the MIDI files as well as the um, some of the, the the chords for some of the music that I already have. So, I mean, let's choose one that already has the MIDI files. So we're gonna think so sacrifice. Mm -hmm. So obviously this is a bit more difficult to replicate. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to just open Alchemy. And then the easiest thing to do is to just drag the stems, the MIDI files. And then we're going to... So all we need to do is just now choose the right sounds. So we want something like a pluck or keys. I could probably start off the I would probably start off with something like that probably just change some of the settings you see there we go okay. 
you on that poppy track. See? And just like that, we already have a track up and ready to go. Again, this demonstration is just to show you what you can actually do with the sample pack. So all you do is just simply create your rhythm and you drag and you drop all of your samples. And then in less than five to 10 minutes, you already have the basic template for the track. Then all you do is just come up with the arrangements for your music, all right? Don't forget to visit my website, www.3squaredmusic.com. Check out the Monarch sample pack. See you guys in a bit.